So you just picked up Samsung's newest flagship, the Galaxy Note 10 Plus, and you're looking to pair your AirPods to it. We're here to walk you through how to pair them with your brand new phone, as well as what features you may miss out on for switching to Android. Thanks for watching Apple Insider. Don't forget to hit that like button and be sure to hit subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you know when we upload new videos. AirPods have become the king of true wireless earbuds taking over the iOS world. Now, fortunately, you don't have to have an iPhone or an iPad to use the AirPods. While you will lose out on a couple of features, here's how you can pair your AirPods with your brand new Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus. So the first thing you should do is start by placing your individual AirPods into the charging case. While the case is open, press and hold the small pairing button located on the back of the AirPods. Press and hold this button until you see the light turn white. Now unlock your Galaxy Note 10 Plus, open the Bluetooth settings menu on your Galaxy Note 10 Plus by swiping down on the notification tray, press and hold down the Bluetooth icon, and this will take you to the phone's Bluetooth settings. Now once you're on that menu, you should see your AirPods among the list of available devices, and here's where you can confirm the pairing. Once you click on the AirPods name, that's it. Super easy and straightforward. You can now listen to your music, movies, podcasts, or whatever else through your AirPods just like any other Bluetooth earbuds. Now there are some trade-offs by using an Android device. Being that other non-Apple devices lack certain aspects, there are a few things that don't work as they do on iOS. Now for starters, as outlined above, the simple and elegant pairing process is a no-go. You're stuck pairing the old-fashioned way versus the simplicity of opening up your AirPods case and hitting connect on the card that pops up on your iPhone. Now the controls on the side of the earbuds also act differently. A double tap on either side of the earbuds will act as a play pause button. On iOS this can be configured to suit your preferences. Now you also don't get to take advantage of the iCloud sharing that seamlessly syncs your AirPods to all of your devices as it does on Mac, iPhone, iPad, Apple TV, and Apple Watch. Now taking out one of the earbuds to pause your music also doesn't work with the Note 10 Plus or any Android devices in general, which is our favorite feature from Apple's AirPods. All in all though, the sound from Apple's AirPods is still good. The range and signal strength is fantastic, they pack a ton of battery life in a small design, and they're iconic enough to be recognized by anyone as you walk down the street. Now whether you're going from an iPhone to a new Galaxy Note 10 Plus, or you already have an Android device but just want to rock Apple's buds, it's extremely easy to pair them to your brand new device. Hey everyone, did you guys like that video? Be sure to click on that like button so we can create content that we know that you guys want to see. And follow Apple Insider on all social media channels. If you want the best prices on any Apple gear, check out the Apple Insider price guide that is updated daily. And until next time, we'll see you later.